Hello and welcome to another match for my career mode, Chelsea versus Arsenal, Capital One Cup. Uh, I'm gonna go with the default 11, my regular 11. I'm not gonna put in Ozil because he's tired, which made my decision easier. Since he's coming, it hasn't been much of a hassle in which three I'm gonna pick, because one of them is usually tired, because midfield is, you know, tiring, I guess. I'll probably take off. I wasn't even trying in that drill. But uh, I'll probably take off one of them at the half and put on. So here we go in the final of the oh, so. Cup. Well, it's Depending on how the match is going, if it's like. A superb game. Chelsea make one change. You know, if it's like 2 0 or something, I'll probably put on Quadrado instead. With John Terry as the centre backs. Paul Pogba starts looking to continue his great form in midfield. In attack, Wayne Rooney starts. He's been in. Great form recently. So, let me know what you think so far of the videos. You know, like, are you enjoying them? Oh, that would have been a great ball. Are you enjoying them? Do you hate them? Are you even watching them? If you're not watching them, you're not listening to me ask you the question. So, you know, there's that. Um. I'm gonna on my old channel. I used to do NBA 2K blacktop videos with my brother's friend and sometimes my brother. So I might start doing those. I might start doing GTA videos. Like, good tap. What was that? As my tweet. We'll see. Like you know, after the channel picks up a bit, hopefully. Cause what I remember from my old, old channel was uh, the first like 20 subscribers is much harder to get than the next 80. Cause once you have you know like a decent amount of subscribers, it's easier to pick up. Because like YouTube is more exponential if you know what that word is. I don't know how to explain it. It's more the growth is exponential instead of I don't know the opposite. Of where I don't even know how to explain it. To be honest. It's like, uh, it's easier to get four babies from two parents and two sets of parents than it is to get four babies from one set of parents. You know what I mean? Double the chances of growth. That's, it's irrelevant to my point. Anyways. Ah, oh, how does he miss that? So if you want to see also, I could do the individual career mode, but I don't really like that. You know, the probably won't do that. The, the one where you take one player and you make him, you know, like you take his, him throughout his life, like he'll play for Arsenal or Man United. You're the player and not the club, basically. So if you guys really want to see that, I can, have, I can ask my brother to do it because he plays that mode. So after this match, I'll do, what time is it? The Chelsea match, like the real life match. Oh, that's still a good ways away. So another three hours, two hours. Neymar. No, what time is it? Three and a half hours, damn. That's still a long ways away, so I'll into an advanced position. do some more Ronaldo. videos until then, I guess. Probably watch Netflix or something. If you, if you guys like Netflix, what shows do you guys like? This is off topic, but. If you've seen Narcos, I'm pretty sure everybody's seen Narcos by now. That's Alexis one of the best shows I've seen. Um, Bojack Horseman. I thought that was going to be a stupid-ass show. Like, based on the premise of it. It's about a horse. In Hollywood. But it is... That was one of the best comedy shows I've seen. In terms of, you know... It's a comedy. It's funny. But it's also got, like, a... You know, like, a feel-good element to it. Kind of like, you know, like, Friends. Um, and also, what else? Peaky Blinders is really good, Sanchez. if you watch that. Well, Hopefully those three shows will have a season, newer Daniel season coming Silva. up this 2016. Um, let's see what else. I can't really think of anything else. So if you know anything else, let me know. Comment. You know. I don't want to be just the guy, you know, who you watch do videos. Maybe like, you know. If you want to chat to me, I don't mind. If you want to get to know me outside of these videos, I don't care. I would be... Unless, you know, like... 
you don't want to do that, which is also fine. Like, if you just want to watch the videos, that's also fine. Oh, oh come on, Rooney. That's the cigarettes right there. The ones he smokes rarely in the offseason. If he didn't, he would have he would have gotten to that ball. Jack Wilshire. Nacho Monreal. But, you know, got a great understanding come on, John. Nice. Very good. It's only the Capital One Cup, to be honest, but it's a big match against Arsenal. Um, really, I don't care if I lose the Capital One Cup. Like, I wouldn't care at all. And the, my main goal this season is to win the Premier League, because last year I was third in it. I won the Champions League last year, so I really... Like, I, I want to still win it, but... Wouldn't be the end of the world if I, if I didn't win it. Aaron Ramsey. And then after this season, I'm going to upgrade the difficulty because I've been winning a bit more than I should be. Like, I've been winning, you know, 2 3 0 too often. 4 0. Rooney's got 22 goals in the Premier League. And the next highest I checked this match, before this match, it was 12. You know, and third is Neymar, and then fourth is Ronaldo. So. I think Kane is second. John Terry. Reception. I hope John Terry doesn't retire. I, I don't know if... I think they don't retire as long as... Well, they're back defending you know, and you cut the got them under... No, I don't know. I don't think Maybe they Because really, right, I've got them under contract for another two after this season. And in goes the cross. Julio Cesar has played much better than Mike Lewis. Nothing's ever straightforward for goalkeepers, but he's uh, not been challenged. But I sold Begovic off for a good amount of money. But the thing is, since it was at the transfer deadline window, uh, fuck. I guess I had no goalie with like three hours left, three, four hours left. So I had to overpay for Cesar. I paid 30 million for him. Because, you know, I had to make sure, one, they didn't counter-offer. Two, I had to make sure they would accept it right away. You know, like, if I, I had to make sure they wouldn't reject it. And two, I had to make sure they wouldn't counter-offer anything. I had to make sure they took it right away. So I'm taking off Fabs for Ozil because of the energy. Um, take off more. Uh, Rune. Did I score? No, I didn't score. Yeah, so I have to play Ozil. I have to keep Rune all the time. And I'm going with Baba for my Tweety again. No, no, I'm going to keep my Tweety on. Is Baba at full better than Danny Alves at half? No, I don't think so. Because Danny Alves is, you know, one of the greatest, in my opinion, to ever play. He's reached that put reached that stage now. Like he's not the best in his position, he's not. You know, but he's up there with the Cafus and the Roberto Carlos, especially from his country. Like consistency wise too, you know, he's not it's not like he played great for one season and then went to shit. Come on, like you good good goalkeeper. Can't say anything. Even though he, he should have caught the first one, but after saving the second one, I can't really say much. Wayne Rooney. Well, this is great oh, look, it's Oscar. Where Come on. The ball he had three assists in one match. I've never had somebody have three assists. Jack Wilshire has given it and got it back again. So how, what, what do you guys think about the transfer window? Who do you, who do you support? Are you a Man U fan? Are you an Arsenal fan? Are you a Chelsea fan? If you're a Chelsea fan, you should just subscribe because, you know, you'll get along very well. But even if you're not a Chelsea fan, you can subscribe. You know. There's no, like, man, like, block you if you're an Arsenal fan or something. You know, but... Uh, if you're a Man U fan, I have Rooney <laughs> and Ronaldo, like you used to have. Sorry. Uh, and in a moment, there will be a substitution. Shit, it's 60 minutes. No goals. I'll put one in. There's Rooney on the run. 
Yeah, it's got a good feel about it. Good defense, good defense. Over there, see if he can set up. Go. Pogba. Ah. In his defense, I don't think Fabs would have finished that either. You'd need a special player to finish that. You'd need who would have finished that. Maybe Neymar, but he that would have been more. It would have needed a stronger player. It would have needed I'm trying to think Gerard or Lampard. Lampard would have finished. That. Lamps would have definitely finished that. A bit biased towards Lampard, but. Oh. I think Lamps would have definitely finished that. In his prime, obviously not right now. Like 38 right now, playing in the MLS. Um, who was it then? Okay, if we're not, we're not gonna go back and like all that, like you know, like retired players. Like Ronaldinho would have finished that. Ronaldo, like the other one, not Cristiano. Cristiano would have also probably finished that. Oof, terrible pass. Let's check and go. So I don't feel too bad of having Ozil. Pogba. That's in. No, oh, man. It's corner at least, right? Okay, I'm going to try and find John Terry in the back. Nope. I didn't find John. Didn't score. Rooney, fuck. Why are you chasing after... You know, Arsenal's at the top of the table now. I, I, they might actually f finish. Hope they don't, but... They, pro they, they could finish. They have a pretty good team this year. They're playing pretty well. Like, they're firing on... You know the expression, like, they're firing on all cylinders. Like, if you have, like, a... Neymar! Oof! Neymar! Oh, come on, come on. You gotta... Okay, I'll finish after this. My point after this. But. The control, it's the turn. Good look here again by the replay of the goal. Um, what I was saying, yeah, like you know, like if you have a machine well, and it's good. working very efficiently, you would say it's firing it's on all down. cylinders, like on all the cylinders. The machine, that's what the Arsenal machine is pretty Thank much you. doing this season. Even if you don't like them, you gotta switch on the attacking power in this situation. Yes, that's pretty much why I got over. I've been watching him. He's been playing very well. Oof, oof, oof. Should I cross it? No. Oh, how did he save that? What's Ronaldo busy about? He got the shot off. How did he save that? Damn. I'm gonna make a substitution. 1 0. Terry's tired. I'm gonna go with Baba for Alves. I'm gonna go. I'd rather have a full energy Baba than 25% Danny Alves. That's it for right now. Um, yeah. It's a make a change. And being behind, you can understand that. I'm gonna change my set tactic, tactics to defensive. Normally, never play defensive, but the last two games I have been. Oh, come on. Because, you know, like they've been big matches. In big matches, if I go up, I'll play defensive. But if it's like, you know, if I'm playing. Oh, John. Uh, Crystal Palace. Well, Crystal Palace is pretty good, doing pretty good in real life, but I'm saying. If I'm playing Crystal Palace, uh, let's change it. Let's say. I'm playing Aston Villa. And I'm up 1-0. I'll probably just continue to attack. I probably won't play defensive. John! Fuck. But you get what I'm saying, right? Like, if you're watching this. Probably. It's not a hard concept. You know? It's not the same thing as that one word I was trying to explain earlier. I forgot what it was. Uh... Oh, wait, yeah, okay, run there, see what happens. Chance to get the ball in the box. Crosses in. I never understand when people push, like, if I push the ball out here, why would you, like, if I, let's say I'm the tagger, 
if I push it out, why is it? Oh yeah, if I push it out really far, why would you chase me? Why wouldn't you just play the center as a defender? Nacho Monreal. Unless you have like Danny Alves, like, like that. Like why would you chase that instead of overlapping? Alexis Sanchez. See right there. If I chased him, I wouldn't have made that tackle. Oscar. Neymar. Ronaldo. Cross to Mooney. And a goal. Never mind. Hopefully on the corner. I'll find John Terry. I see him. Right. Over it. Right over him. I never map it right. If I can get the ball to do it, I'm pretty sure that's a foul. 1-0 oh, in the Capital One Cup. Did I win the Capital One Cup? Why are they so happy? It's just the Capital One Cup. It looks like I won it. I didn't even know this was the final, to be honest. Is that happy? Yeah, it's the Capital One Cup victory. It looks like. Unless it's... Yeah, they wouldn't be this happy for a semi... Yeah. Champions, champions, ole, ole, ole. I mean, it's still a cup. John Terry, fucking legend. I really don't think they'll remember the Capital One Cup for the rest of their lives. Probably forget it. That's why it was Arsenal in the final. It makes more sense. Ah, it's not even the FA Cup. The F I, I guess. Okay, thank you for watching. Comment, like, subscribe. John Terry holding up another cup. Good thing I didn't sell him off because, you know, then I don't think in the video he would be holding a cup. Because one time I subbed him off and, you know, uh, I put on Thiago Silva. So, no, no, not, I didn't put on Thiago Silva. Thiago Silva became captain. Because, you know, once you sub off the captain, it just automatically picks the next captain. doesn't even let you choose. So, and then he lifted the trophy... Not a bad match. Let's see who had the assists for Neymar. Mm. Tackles one. Who played the best? Defensively, John Terry. Obvious. Who your assists are? It's because my defense is really good, man. I said this earlier, but basically, the reason why my goalies keep getting all these high ratings is because my defense is good and the opposing team just takes shitty shots. Okay, thank you for watching.